Hey guys, Mike with Brief Reviews. Spent the day with the S24 Ultra and the S24 Plus today, and would like to say they are good phones. Highly recommend both of them. Depending on what size you like, you might like this size better on the Plus, or the bigger Ultra with, with the S Pen. Little different on the openings of the speakers, but I really like the new flat screen all the way. The display's flat. That's how it should always be. And I like the only the edge is a little bit curved of the glass. S24 Plus, it's, it's flat all the way across. So yeah, both good phones. You can see the new always on displays have backgrounds and you can disable those so you have the standard black background if you like. But yeah, let's go in and check out the phones a little bit. Did some photo testing. I don't know if you can see the differences on the on the camera with this phone, but they're pretty similar. Um, I'm impressed that the S24 is keeping up right with the Ultra. If not, sometimes better. That one got twisted around. Little video. Quite comparable. Outside shot, ultra plus. Let's see if we can zoom in a little bit. Well, a little different view, trying to find the same. Both are pretty good. Maybe a little more clarity on that one. Yeah, so camera's quite, quite comparable, um, which I really like that. My myself, I'm gonna use the S24 Plus. I like the size, the rounded corners, camera and screen is pretty much the same. Yeah, I, I like that. Uh, let's see, a couple of other features. Can I see the brightness? Um, I mentioned on another video that only the Ultra gets the reduced glare on the screen. The Plus does not have that. I don't know if you can tell, sometimes it seems like to me the screen is a little darker because of that. A little bit less clarity and brightness on the Ultra compared to the Plus. We've got them both maxed out, extra bright. Oh, a new, new feature is adaptive color tone, similar to iPhone, I guess. And just make sure we're matching here, and we are. It's got the same color tone option. So yeah, looks pretty much like the iPhones. So some cool new features. Um, I do like that you can, to search something, you can hold down and circle. Well, I thought I had it on set up on this one. Oh, yep, yeah, it is working. Never mind. Um, now I can't see the photo circle. <laughs> so 
So let's go search for swans. I guess I should have done them at the same time. Yeah, let's do that. Let's see. Let's do alligators. About the same. So you can hold down. Same on both. And then you can circle, search for alligators. So if you're searching for items to buy, you can circle an item and it'll give you the pricing and where to buy those same items. So pretty cool. And tested out the translate features. Those work well. Um, yeah, two good phones. I'll put the price links down below with discount pricing. That's what I meant to say. And yeah, if you have any comments, please leave those below and let us know what one you would choose. I like the smaller form form factor of the little thinner, shorter, not as wide. So yeah, I like that. So anyway, until next time, we'll catch you guys later. See ya.